Alright, we are back. This is Let's Play Dragon Age Origins. I'm your host, Lordbot, and I hope this episode goes a bit better than the ones before. But first Indeed. of all, let's um, yes. gather our party and move on. It is time to... Oh my, I don't even know. Um, to... Ban Lawrence land, so I guess. There we go. Walking about. Ah. Who are they? And uh, take a closer look at the unearned man. You are surprised to recognize the uniform of King Kalen. Oh, intriguing. Take a cl closer look at the guards. Okay. Wait for the... Well... I think we can... Join. Oh my. That didn't go too well. Okay, cutscene is over and it's fight time. I guess we need to put out... Well, you can't hear this. I'm going to cut this out. Alright, the cutscene is over. What should we do then? Now, I don't even know how Sten is going to work here. Okay, mighty blows, threaten, taunt. Okay, yeah, that's good enough. Um, can I? Wow, I can. That's awesome. Here we go. Now then all of us should probably actually... Morrigan. Attack the ma um, that guy there. Good work. Then use that. Alright, good work. Now then you. I guess you can attack that guy with his uh, mighty blows. Here we go. Good work. Ah, you couldn't quite use the healing force this in time. Okay, keep fighting. There we go. Oh wow, that was a bit too close. Okay, keep fighting them. Um, there we go. Good work with the crippling shot. Now all of you attack that guy. That went well enough. I wish um, my Gunnar wouldn't have died again. Here we go. Good work. Is there a cutscene incoming? There probably is. Let's put the... Uh... Oh god. I am ready for cutscenes. Let's take the elf roots first, because they can be made into potions of sorts. And then let's go down there to talk about the dead body we just found. Oh, actually there's death roads here too. Let's of take that too. Here we go. Um, yeah, I remember him. Okay. Well, he's dead now, sadly. Perhaps you can find something on him. Oh, he's still alive? Thank you. I, I didn't expect the band's men to notice my escape so quickly. I tried to hide here in the woods, but there wasn't time. And now I'm a dead man. Well, what do you mean there wasn't time? You were there in Ostago. You know how things went. For me, it was either this, or die in some dark spawn's belly, or, or be hung as a deserter. Ah, uh, yes, I recognize your face. You were there with the Grey Wardens, one of Duncan's new recruits. I was to guard the king. He was my friend, understand? Make her. 
all that time in Ban Loren's prison, and I couldn't stop thinking about all they suffered that one dark night at Ostagar. It's not your fault they died. I know. Even had Loghain's men not turned their backs on us, the Darkspawn were too many. Even Kaelin, for all his bravado, knew there would be no victory at Ostagar. The king entrusted me with the key to the royal arms chest. If anything were to happen to him, he said, it was vital I deliver it to the wardens. Do you still have this key? The Maker has a sense of humor, doesn't he? I suppose it's for the best, however. Had I kept it, it would be in Ban Loren's hands by now. I was afraid. I thought I would lose it on the battlefield, so I stashed it in the camp. Please, it's probably still there. You don't think the Darkspawn found it? I hope not. Would they know how to work the lock even if they did? The key's behind a loose stone at the base of a statue. I'll draw a map for you, so you'll know where to search. If you have any survivors of the battle among your companions, take them with you. Their memory of the terrain will serve you well. I'm only sorry I cannot join you. It is vital that the King's documents do not fall into the wrong hands. As for Marek's sword, it is too powerful to be poured at by those monsters. Same for the King's other arms and armor. And... And if you happen to find Caelan's body, see it off. He was our king. He shouldn't be left to rot amidst the Darkspawn's filth. <laughs> and so he dies. Well, a good return, but it's probably full of Darkspawn, so I really don't want to that much. Um, that thing can go away now. I think the Prisa striking can stay. And we should move on. Yeah, there's a new thing in there, I guess, but, um... Soldier's Peak? Well, we could go there and try to find things. Or we could go to Frostback Mountains. I think we should go to the mountains now. Actually, before we do that, I do s want to save. Here we go, and now we can move on. Or not. Oh, there we go. Yeah, let's go to the mountain. We need to go to... Um... Okay. Another fight, I see. No. It's not a fight so far. Let's take the elf root. Let's create myself a bit more of the... Postices. And then let's talk to him. Do you have coin, stranger? With Orzammar closed off, old Tegrin can give you a discount. Fine weapon and arms, dwarven made. Um, what's going on in Orzammar? There's two things I'm here for. Travel or trade. Understand? Let's see the di this discount of yours. Anything good about? Um, well, you have some bolts, but I don't really use bows that much. You're, um, well... These are actually good. Well, kinda. Let's see, anything good around here? Uh, well, not really that much anything interesting. Too bad you don't have any potions with you. That would be useful. Um, do I have anything to sell to you? I guess that... No, I don't really. Okay, fair enough. Oh, I should probably make Sten have some better armor on and use that as soon as he gets out of this. Chainmail boots. Yeah, these are a bit better. Now then, this chainmail here, or this one. Um, I mean, yeah, heavy chainmail, yes. I guess you can have that. It makes you a bit large, but that's fine. Um, okay. I think that's good enough for you. Let's keep moving. Um, why is this place here? Oh, that's it? Okay. Oh, actually, I am kind of getting paranoid of needing to load saves from far away, so let's keep saving. And move on. 
to the mountains. Frostback Mountain Pass. I can't see anyone so far. And I just can't seem to find the right way this time. Okay, let's try this again. This time, let's go for the mage again. First, because the mage is the most important thing. There we go. And he just got stunned. That's great. You two. Just kill somebody. I don't care who. Alright. Shattering shot, sir. Sten. You can um, taunt them. And put the ma HP on you. work. Alright. Ten Morrigan. And the other girl. Attack that bounty hunter. And you can just keep running about and letting them kill these guys. There we go. Okay, you... Morrigan, could you keep your target on one person? That would be very useful. Alright, here we go. Run! From them. Good work. Running about like a crazy person. And she, he's dead finally. Good. Hooey. Okay, kill this guy now. We are running out of healing force to this Sathlin. There we go, they're dead, finally. Now Polaris, you can take That's the stuff the bounty have. hunters had. Delighted. And we can move on. All right. Let's save here. Where are those two? Am I oh. I didn't pick up that guy. Okay. Let's go pick this guy's remains. There we go. Firebolt. That was pretty r rough of us. But we are at the entrance of Os Osamar. Are we descending into the underground? The thought of so much rock over one's head is disquieting. Is it now? Well, before we do, I do want to. If there's civil war, what will happen to the us? King's Let's right see, over king. where is Trade some um, people who can uh, buy stuff and sell stuff? Ah, uh, you're just surface dwarfs. No, there's Farron. Maker's breath, is that? Oh, I beg your pardon. Can I help you, friend? Is something wrong? No, no, nothing at all. Just, uh, you know, thought I saw something. Since you are clearly looking at me, I would say that you do see something. Well, um, yes. Never you mind. Can I help you? What do you sell here? Well, little of this, little of that. You know, uh, used armor mostly. Nothing um, that would really interest fine people like yourselves. 
Is it refreshing or unsettling that this merchant is reluctant to show us his wares? Um, that's an odd attitude for a merchant. Well, I'm considerate of my customer's time, that's all. What reassuring certainty. Ah, uh, let me take a look. Oh, uh, certainly. Thank you. Crater Lyrium Potion. Um, yeah, Crater Lyrium Potion recipe, I don't really mind that that much, but if there will be recipe for, let's say, I don't know, something good. Daltahan. I don't have enough strength for that. It's a two-handed weapon, though, and pretty good one, too. It seems. Gunari sword. That's, um, frightening. It's two-handed, too. Dwarven longsword. That's only main hand. And Dalish longbow. Anything good here? Rapid aim. Huh. Oh, that sounds like a good thing. Magic stuff. Uh, nothing that interesting. You actually have very good stuff here, now that I'm seeing it. But it's quite expensive too, so I'm not buying all of it. I can sell those fire bolts. I don't need them. Um. Okay, that's interesting. Let's see, anything else around? Duster's... Duster leather armor. Oh, well it's tier 3, perhaps I can use that. For now, I don't mind. Let's um, see what the other people have to say. Ah, Ahren! You were in the Chantry. You are a priest? No, no. I was a lay sister of the Chantry. Which means... I lived and worked in the Chantry. But I did not take any vows. So okay. you dabbled in priesthood then. Also, I forgot to do this again. And oh no. Don't have the same sorts of duties as priests at all. So you were not a priest, did none of their duties, and took no vows, but you lived among them? Yes. Ah. You were a house guest of the chantry? Um Sort of. <laughs> That's intriguing. Oh, you wish to talk to me? <laughs> Truly, it's a courtesy for one so well-armed to notice a lonely merchant. Did you lose your caste when you left Orzammar? It's not your business. But like my father, I was born on the surface. We never had a caste to leave. The assembly says we've turned our back on the stone. But they still use the goods we bring. Hypocrites. That's not right. Someone should do something. Maybe it'll change by the time my children are grown. Um, how often do you risk talking, Orzammar? Twice a year. I'm confined to a trade stall in the commons, but I see enough. It's very... closed in. My grandfather says I've lost my stone sense. I was born topside. I don't remember having it. I don't mind. I should go. Best Actually, of luck to you. I have no idea. I might be over time, so, um... I think this was it for this episode, and I'll see you next time on Dragon Age Origins, where we go in Orzammar, hopefully.